Hi, and welcome to Jerry's Engineering Corner. My name is Jerry DiBattista, and I am the Global VP of Forex's Vertec PTFE Business Group. And thank you for watching. You can see other videos in the series if you go to forex.com under the Marketing tab, look for Reflective Media, or just go to the website below. We also have a YouTube page, just look for forex.com. Today, we're going to take a small piece of black plastic to simulate an object in our simulated disinfection chamber. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the object in and we're going to move it around to see if there's any kind of shadowing effect or, to, or the effect of, of the flat side or the uh, thick side uh, being exposed to the light. So our initial reading is around 1530 and we'll insert the uh, object and you can see what happens as the object is inserted the amount of energy drops down to about 1200 which means the object is absorbing around 320 or 330 uh, milliwatts. If you turn it you can see it really doesn't change much so it doesn't matter if it's at a 90 degree angle or straight up and down the object is absorbing about the same amount of energy. So the shadowing effect is minimized. What's interesting is that if you put something that's reflective in there, like the Porex Vertec, you can see adding it makes almost no change at all. Which means there is virtually no shadowing going on in the box that's lined with the Porex Vertec. I have now switched the flashlight and the detector to the aluminum box. So this has no 4x vertex lining on the inside and there's nothing in the box itself and you can see the reading is only 176 so same exact amount of energy the meter is uh, reading the same and you can see the energy output has gone so much because the box itself is absorbing the majority of the UV light uh, that is uh, being reflected so if you look here you put it in straight and you see a drop but as you turn it you can see some variability in the reading. Not much, but some. What's interesting is when you put the Porex Vertec in, because it's so highly reflective, you can watch the energy output go up dramatically just by adding the reflective material in the box. As was evident by the experiment we ran today, Putting a simulated object that you're trying to disaffect into the chamber absorbs a great deal of energy, which tells you that it's being disinfected, no matter the orientation. Either direction, it's getting about the same amount of energy. And this was proven by putting something reflective in it where you saw no change. So we're getting minimal, if no shadowing, in our box uh, with, with the product, no matter the orientation. So, that's it today for me, Jerry with a G.